Hey guys, welcome back today. So today we're going to be unboxing another new box on my channel that I've never opened before, but I'm really excited about it because it's new to me and it's something different to unbox as well. So we are going to be opening up the Say It With Grace box. And look at this packaging. Isn't this adorable? I even wore stripes to match the box because I was like, this is so cute. I love it. I should have done green eyeshadow instead. I was trying to go for a pop of color because you know me, I love my pops of color. But this packaging is on point and it's so cute. And as you can see, there's an envelope because this box is a stationary box. So I'm really, really excited about this one. It's something new and fresh and I've not opened truthfully a lot of stationary boxes on my channel before. So I thought this would be something fun to try out. So we're gonna go ahead and look into it. This particular box is a quarterly subscription, so it's four times a year. It will cost you $39.99 a quarter plus a $10 shipping fee. So for a grand total, you're looking at about 50 bucks for this box when all is said and done. So we open it up and this is what our packaging looks like. The packaging snob geek inside of me is freaking out right now because I'm already like, look at this, it just keeps continuing. The outside's good, the inside's good. So we've got some like rope tethered together here and we have a little wooden moon. So I'm gonna take this off and on top, I've already got some cards. So the top card that I have on here is actually a thank you card from the owner and it says, welcome to the Say It With Grace family. I'm so glad we are part of this movement. Dare to dream big with Grace Shonda. So that's awesome. And then it also mentions that they have all of their social media available, that if you post your boxes on social media, you can actually be entered to win a free box on them as well. So, okay, awesome. I do this for business. I don't really need to be entered to win one, but thank you for the opportunity. All right, let's go ahead and take a peek underneath then. Woo! And here is what our box looks like underneath here then. So it looks like we do have a guide and then all of our items are below. All right. So the theme for this box is Boho Summer Nights. This box was curated with the dreamers in mind. We have packed this box with giftable items this quarter for you to share with your friends who need a boost to remind them to follow their dreams. Okay, so let's go ahead and check it out. The first thing that I have is Be A Dreamer and it looks like this is a pack of note cards. There's six cards in here, but they all have a slightly different design on them. So here's what the first one looks like. So these cards are $12.45 then. Let's go ahead and open it up and look at what they look like. So all of these note cards do come with plain white envelopes and then they are all white and plain inside of the cards. So you can fill these out however you would like to. So this was our first one here where it says be a dreamer. And then the next one says born to chase the moonlight. That's cute. Oh, I love this one. It says follow your heart. This is so cute. That one is really, really cute. The next one says we grow through both victories and defeats. And then it says open mind, big dreams and wild heart. So these all kind of are like the same theme and they're all tied together with the same colors. So I do like that. And then here is our last one then. So I love that they all have this like purple and black vibe. I think it's really cute. They're very sophisticated, but my favorite card is this one. It's so cute. I could do a whole box of just this and I would love it. All right. Next thing that I have inside here then is a black sticky notepad. Oh gosh. So here are our sticky notes and they are all black. My first thought is how am I going to be able to read anything off of these on a black sticky notepad? It's unique. I will give them that. So this particular notepad is $2.49. It says black stationery is making a comeback and it's on trend currently. I don't really know enough about the stationery world to know what's on trend or not. So if she says so, great, I'll just take it for that then. Now, hallelujah, there is a white gel pen that comes with it because yeah, I mean, even blue on that is not going to show up. So this is a jelly roll pen. It's number eight and it is white. 
So here's what our pen looks like. These totally remind me of the gel pens that I had in high school growing up. We had gel pens everywhere and they smelled good too on some of them. So this particular gel pen will cost you $4. It says these are also making a comeback and they pair great with the black sticky notes. So I get that, but truthfully, I mean, if you lose the white pen, the black sticky notes are worthless to me at that point because I can't read anything off of it then. So let's just hope that I don't ever lose the white pen. And how many of us have white pens just lying around as backups? <laughs> All right, next thing that I have then, ooh, this is cute. This is a little burlap bag and there's some lace around it. It's just a drawstring bag. So I'm sure you could just carry something with this. <laughs> So this retails for $2.49 then. Okay, so I got a little burlap bag. Not super exciting. Um, next thing that I have are Dreamer Cards of Intent. Okay, so here's our bag. What are Cards of Intent? So these cards have a $20 retail. I have to read here, it says, this is for the person who has big dreams but is stuck and in need of direction to move forward. The deck comes with a set of 24 cards and a reusable pouch. So these are what the backs of the cards look like. And then she's incorporated the design that she created in the different purples and whites all together on these cards. And they have different things that you can say on them. So it says like, take time out of your hectic schedule this week and set aside for a you day. You deserve to treat yourself. Um, fear will make you believe things that aren't true. Don't let fear hold you back. They're almost like pep talk cards. Like, like, go, you can, <laughs> I don't, these are weird to me. I don't feel like these are useful at all. Um, and it's definitely not what I was expecting for stationary, but I'm like, I don't know. Maybe these work for somebody, but they're not for me, and I just think it's kind of a weird thing to put in the box. They're not totally useful. I would have preferred to have like more pens and more stationery than just cards, I guess. Okay, um, next thing that I have is a coaster. This is a wooden coaster. It's made from teak, and it retails for $6.49. It says this item is made in Bali, and it's a teak coaster that you can use as decor or an actual coaster for your drink. So this does make sense to me. I get why this is in there because if you've got your stationery, you're writing your letters, your cards, you've got to have your drink. So, okay. The thing that I have is a rock. Not joking. I have a rock. This is raw crystal. It's $2 and it's a rose quartz crystal. They also had amethyst. So that would have varied depending on your box. Huh, am I supposed to use this as like a paperweight? This is getting very weird now. Um, next, oh gosh. So, <laughs> this is a white sage bundle and you can light this. This is just not at all what I thought this was going to be. Like, I thought we had a stationary box. I'm gonna double check. I've got my iPad here and we're going to double check that I ordered the right box. So this is definitely a stationary box or supposed to be. And that's what I pulled up here, even on crate Joy, where this is originally found. And it says that it's a premium stationary box. So sorry. It's so reflective. You guys, I've got like the glass screen protector on here. So this is definitely going a different route than what I originally thought this box to be. Um, the next thing that I have, is a dream catcher. So I guess at this point, I'm a little, wow, this is massive. Holy bananas. This is huge. This retails for $23 then, and it was also handcrafted in Bali. So I guess I'm a, I don't know. Um, this is definitely not where I thought it was going to go at all with this. I don't feel for $50 that you're getting a lot from this. It's a lot of little things. I mean, a little bag of burlap with lace around it. It's like, that's a dollar store item. These cards of intent that I don't really have a use for, you can find those at a dollar store again. Um, the black sticky note pad and white gel pen, a couple bucks. 
I'm not seeing the value for this box to equal $50. That's a lot of money to put out on a box. And especially when you're thinking it's one thing and it's a totally different box than what you're receiving. Um, so I don't know. This box is really bizarre to me, but I definitely don't see the value of $50 here. A coaster, a rack, a sticky notepad, a pen are not going to equal $50. So that's kind of where I'm at with this box, you guys. So comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this box. I'm really bummed. I thought this was going to be great, but I'm like, I don't, I don't really, I don't really like this box. And I don't say that very often, but I really don't. I don't like this box. So truthfully, because I feel like we lost money on this, I don't feel like I can give this a high rating today. Um, so I'm going to go with two stars on this box just because Three is always my break even point and I don't feel like we even hit that. I, I don't think this was all that great. Comment, give me your feedback you guys. Let me know what you think and we'll chit chat all about it. Until next time, have a great rest of your day and I will see all of you guys soon. Bye.